Okay, we're just doing a, a quick overview of the DesignJet 4000. Uh, quite a large machine, uh, running HP double sway technology. I'll show you what that is in a in a minute. Um, HP claiming 100 A1 prints an hour, and it really is quite an impressive machine. Um, let's go through. Okay, standard platen there. Vacuum fan holds the paper down um, while the carriage comes across to actually print. I'll pull the carriage out, so open up the right hand cover. Uh, don't ever do this with the machine powered on because you will damage the machine. You can uh, pull the service station forward that houses the print head cleaners. There's the print head cleaners there, replaceable item. Uh, they come with every, every new print head. And let me just pull the carriage out. Okay, and we'll show that the double suede technology, what we're talking about, it's a four ink system on this machine, but we can see there are eight print heads, each one of them doubled up. Yeah, so we've got two print heads for each colour, just means it can lay down ink twice as quickly. Okay. Uh, come over to the left hand side and show you the ink reservoirs on this machine. Um, comes as standard with 225 mil inks. A uh, much better value for money is to actually purchase the 400 mil inks that come with the machine. So they're housed in there. Pull them forward. As you can see, really quite an impressive reservoir of ink at 400 mil. Um, so really will last some time. A uh, very economical machine. Okay, capable of taking anything up to a 42 inch roll, I think we've currently got a 33 inch roll loaded on the machine here uh, and we'll print a photographic quality at that size come around to the back of the machine very difficult to see because the HP have buried it um, but what we've actually got in there got some fire wire connections and got an ethernet connection so local area network connection there built in a standard. Um, parallel as well, though I've never seen one of these machines set up with just a parallel. That's really all we need to know about the DesignJet 4000 that can't be read on a spec sheet.